In my early 20s, I dated a good friend, which was great for a few months. But then we started having increasing tension over issues like how much time we spent together and what we did with that time. She even broke up with me during the first wave of this tension, and I was sad but also relieved. But then the next day, she changed her mind, and not sure enough of myself, I decided to go along. For the next six months, I was ambivalent. We continued to have essentially the same disagreements repeatedly, as many couples do. I could tell that my investment in the relationship was falling, but I cared about her and admired her. We had been very close friends before we dated. I also liked having a partner. She was only my second serious relationship after a long teenage period of feeling like I would never get there. So I avoided the problem. It was usually easy to just keep coasting along. Finally, I started seriously considering ending it. Our simmering tension was boiling over more often, and I also went through a stressful personal situation, which made me realize that when times were hard, I was more drawn to the comforts of my friends than of my girlfriend. And then, timing aligned where I had planned a week-long solo vacation which gave me room to breathe and also to experience what life was like without her. I embraced this opportunity to slow down, to journal, and to take bike rides in nature. As my vacation was nearing the end, there were still thoughts in my head pushing me both ways. What if you break up and regret it? What if you're alone forever? What if you stay and regret it? But with that distance and chance to slow down, I could tell when it really came down to it that breaking up was the right choice. I didn't have more to give that relationship. The most important thing I did in retrospect was choosing to really believe myself. I have a strong tendency to second guess and change my mind, but I saw that coming ahead of time. I decided that if I was going to end it, it needed to be a final decision. I knew that getting back together would be a temptation, but not right for either of us. So I stuck to that plan. After my vacation, we had a long, hard talk where I told her my decision and stayed firm to it. Within just a few weeks, I felt completely certain of my decision. With the space and closure that came with the breakup, I could feel that things were better on the other side. I had a few more deeply emotional journaling sessions and was able to process the prior year and articulate lessons from it. I'm so thankful that I found the right conditions for discerning what I really needed, and that once I saw it almost clearly, I pushed myself to be decisive.